we were just at the wholesale. There's three grocery stores here. And two of them, I know their policy is to discount broken packages and like sad produce. Sad fruits and vegetables. And this one also has fruit for kids. Anyways, so I was going to get flour and sugar. That's what I came here for. Because they have big bags of organic flour and organic sugar. And they all have, they're all ripped. And they have this repack tape on them. And there was a guy right there. So I was like, do you guys ever discount repack, like those repacked flowers? He's like, yeah, I'll give you 50% off if you want to buy it. And I was like, I'll take both those bags of flowers and the sugar and the steel cut oats. So guys, we just saved ourselves a boatload of money because that flour is $55 a bag, sugar is 33 and the steel cut oats are $43 a bag. And I got them all 50% off. So I saved $20 in the steel cut oats. That was 25 pounds of that. 25 pounds of cane sugar, I saved $17.50 and 40 kilos which is 88 pounds of the organic unbleached white flour it's kind of a bread flour i saved 54 to 78 plus we bought grapes mandarins because freya had been begging for oranges rowan is bouncing around over here freya had been begging for oranges and these grapes are locally grown um, like in our province and that's only a once a year thing plus we had to buy some uh, dark chocolate caramel pretzels for a little treat so this total, guys, this is what it would cost to buy like two bags of flour. While I was talking on my phone, um, the person who was parked next to me came up and that's always kind of awkward when you're just like standing there talking about your groceries to your phone. Um, I did get some packages. We're gonna go to Judo. I'm all over in the parking lot there. I'm gonna show you what we got. So we're gonna go in just a minute, but I'm just gonna show you what else I got. So we're gonna get this video done before we even go to get home. So, in the mail, is she drinking her bottle? Could you help her out? Can you hold it up a bit for her? Thank you so much. So, I ordered a new camera. I'm very excited. It has not come yet, but my mic has come. So I got a mic and a windsock a duber thing. That should be in the other package. We're gonna go in just a second for you. So, because we have a lot of wind where we live, so that wind sock is gonna hopefully cut down on that noise and improve our sound. Okay, so that should be in this package. Everything for the camera is arriving this week, but the camera doesn't arrive till next week. Yeah, I'll show you what's in it. So, here is my tripod. I was told this is the tripod to get. It is a Joby Gorilla Pod. And this is, like there's different weight ratings and this one is the appropriate for the camera I got. Um, here's my wind sock. When someone's walking in front of me, hopefully they don't think I'm weird. We all know I'm weird anyways. Anyways, here's the wind sock. And here is memory card. So I have everything but the camera. So this is going to be one of the last videos that is recorded on my phone. Soon, I'll have a camera! Okay, and the last fun package. This, um, the homeschooling program that we use. So we're in British Columbia, Canada. And here, you either need to register your kids for as homeschoolers, and then you don't have to report anything, and you don't have to like be accountable to anybody but your kids are like registered like hey cool we got it covered or you can enroll them in a program where you have to you still get to choose your own curriculum but you have to report kind of your progress and in exchange for reporting your kids get um a transcript like they can get a diploma can you help her drink her bottle please and then we're gonna get out in just a minute and we get funding. We get a thousand dollars per school age kid. So that's only two for me. Still, that's a large chunk of money that I can spend on curriculum and books and art supplies and music lessons and sports and such. And it's really cool. All these packages won't open. Also, they, the school we're using, Heritage Christian Online School, they have a physical library. 
and you can get seven shipments of books. So I tried it out with a small shipment of books. I actually didn't really mean to actually officially get it, but apparently I did click that I wanted this shipment now. It was kind of confusing. Anyways, they pay shipping both ways to you. So that was kind of cool. Yeah, I'm gonna show you. So because we have a book, um, do to do. Just give me a second for it. Because our first unit study is on birds, I got it all on birds. So we have this one on birds. There you go, Fran. So if you saw my last town hall, we got a bunch of bird books at the library too. So at the library here. So we are like set for bird books. Um, I think I'm going to, from the physical library, the next thing I'm going to do is get a bunch of books for Mac because that kid is burning through books. Baby birds. Bible animals. And about birds. So next time I'm going to order a lot more books. Uh, as I said, I kind of accidentally ordered. I didn't think that it was actually going through, and it was. Yes, friend, now we're going to go in. I'm just going to put this back in. There's also some papers there that I needed to keep. Oh, good. There's like important notes. There we go. Things to remember. How to return the books. So, now we're going to go inside and watch those boys play judo. But I need to keep that receipt. We'll put it in my fancy dancy filing system. So, this was a very small town hall, but it was kind of just like a, we need to go to town. Also, it's getting very warm in this vehicle. I'm sweating. Okay, Freya, let's go watch some judos. We're playing a game like, like British Bulldog. And someone's coming at me, and I'm the Bulldog, and I want to get him. If he starts pushing toward me because he's trying to get the other side, I hop through and straight into the hole down, right? If Mr. Gautier and I are playing British Bulldog, and he tries to go one way or the other around me, I can still use my throw. So we're done judo. I'm ready to go home now. Six o'clock. We're not leaving till you're buckled. Ava, we don't need to cry about it. You can just ask for help. Okay, guys, we're gonna go bring my niece home and go quickly eat some leftovers for dinner. We got taco makings in the fridge. And then milk the cow. First, put the kids to bed and then milk the cow. So she's gonna be milked late tonight. But that's okay. She'll be okay.